Hey guys, it is me, Happy Sarek, and welcome to Last Generation Survival. So as you have already read the title, we've gotten a brand new LDOE update, but it isn't what you think because we haven't really gotten lots of new things. Actually, we have gotten something new and I'm going to talk about that very soon, but I want to show you what this uh, new update kind of had. Uh, like some sort of patch notes, even though these are not even patch notes. But hey, that's what developers said about the new update. Hey, everyone, update 1.23.0 has come out on iOS, Google Play, and Galaxy Store. It contains some technical improvements and fixes certain bugs. It is necessary for the app's stable performance. The update will come out on other platforms a bit later. Have a good game. So that was about it. They haven't mentioned anything new. I don't really know if the game will have now less crashes. Will it load faster? Is it useful, as they said, for the future updates? Regardless, whatever they've done there, there is something, ladies and gentlemen. So when you click on this green zone, now it looks like you can auto-clear it by just watching an ad. I'm not really sure how many times you can do this, but you can auto-clear now these zones by watching ads, which I think is a W that does get my approval. Why not? Before you had to use rations, now... You can at least auto clear this stuff. You'll be able to get some pine logs, which is absolutely awesome. Now, the other thing that I want them to add, speaking of those ads, would be cool to add the ability to to, to reroll perks in the laboratory with those ads. That's the other thing that I want, because right now you can only skip those perks using coins. So I want them to add that stuff in the laboratory. However, it's nice that at least we can skip the green zones with ads. It doesn't really look like you can do anything with orange zones. Oh no, I went back to the base. It, you can also auto clear stuff with the, the in the green in the green stone locations as well. So that was about it. I think that's all we've had in the new update. So sadly, we didn't get anything too crazy. But as developers said already in in the past, like a couple of days ago or a couple of weeks ago, that April isn't going to have anything too crazy. It'll be just a technical update. And yeah, there we go. There's the green zone that we can auto clear using ads. Uh, let's maybe. Uh, auto clear one of the green zones. Wait, let's do this then. I'm just gonna hide it so that you don't see the ads, ladies and gentlemen. And let's do it. There we go. There is an ad playing. And while the ad is playing, I might as well show you something epic. Maybe like psych. What epic? There we go. This thing. So developers have added something else, another sneak peek, right? We're going to talk about it again, but basically Boar and Trap sounds like a great name for a tavern. But remember, both of our guests you're going to meet in May are extremely dangerous and are for uh, unforgiving when you make mistakes. Stay alert. So that is uh, interesting. So it looks like we're going to get like some sort of boars and bear traps or they say boar and traps, whatever. Uh, during May update, and the May is going to be the last in Earth Survival's anniversary update, the seventh uh, year anniversary update. Well, this ad is very long. It is very long, ladies and gentlemen. The ad does not want to disappear. Okay, very soon, soon it'll disappear. I assume. And I still have to wait four more seconds. Waited a minute, and I still have to wait four more seconds. Unbelievable. So another filthy animal in last generation. Well, apparently. Ladies and gentlemen. And there we go. Just by watching an ad, we were able to auto clear one of these zones, which is pretty cool. Right? Can we do it again? Okay, so you can do it every seven hours, every six hours or something. Maybe you cannot do it all the time, but at least you can auto clear it once a day. Hmm. So you cannot auto clear it 10 times, but at least you can auto clear it once. Still, it's cool for the free to play. I think it's I think it's pretty useful. I, I do like this feature. Oh, and you can only you cannot auto clear the green stone zone. So it doesn't really look like you can auto clear a lot of those things, but at least doing it once is definitely better than nothing. So even though this update is very small, but at least we have gotten something, ladies and gentlemen. And yeah, as I said, it looks like we're gonna get like something else here. A new filthy animal during the May update during the seventh year anniversary update. So that is uh, pretty cool. There was probably something else the developers had. I No, actually, there's nothing else. I don't think I have anything. Oh, yeah, only this uh, boar trap. So, do we have the bear trap already in the game? Can we craft it? Is that a thing even? Where would it even be? And if there are any new things... Can you guys let me know? 10 minutes, fine, but 7 hours? I don't know why we have to wait 7 hours to auto-clear. But again, it's better to auto-clear at least once than zero. 
But I maybe mean, later on, we they will allow us to auto-clear more than just once. Oh, we do have the bear trap. But hey, it requires tungsten. So what? Tungsten is coming to the game? I doubt it, ladies and gentlemen. Say, so we do not have these uh, bear traps. But we can see them over here. So the bear traps are coming, I guess. But, uh... Yeah, the bear trap is coming. But it'll probably be only during the event, and they can probably change the recipe. So yeah, I don't think that we're, we're getting tungsten during this update, guys. Developers said that we're not getting tungsten, so I am sure we're not getting any tungsten, guys. So don't worry about that. <laughs> don't worry about tungsten. Tungsten coming. Nah, nah, nah. Developers said that no helicopter and tungsten in May. They have confirmed that no helicopter and tungsten in May, so it's not coming out. But hey, at least they've shared a sneak peek, so that's a W. It might have been a very small update, but hey, now you can auto-clear the green zones at least once or twice uh, a day. It depends how many hours you have to wait there, but hey, at least once a day is already epic. Better than zero times a day. So I do like that. So now what we have to do is work on our base. We got some more ash planks to get. And now you have like 40 FPS instead of 60 after the update. Is that true? Can anybody else confirm that the game started working even worse? Can anybody else confirm that the performance has dropped? Because that would be unbelievable. Okay, we're gonna get some... Fine planks. We're gonna get some iron. We're gonna get some ash logs. And I'll probably keep repeating those new updates and new changes in the upcoming sneak peek. The, the upcoming whatever thing. The sneak peek that we've gotten for the upcoming update. Throughout this entire live stream. So welcome to all those that have just joined to the stream. Glad to see all of you here. And if you're watching this live stream after it's over, then head to the pinned comments down below. There you can find timestamps and you can navigate to your favorite parts of the live stream a bit quicker. Like us doing raids, us doing other things. And etc, etc. It didn't drop for me. The update has to be there. If you can't access it, try to... If it didn't update uh, automatically, try to update it manually. Did you see the recycling skip? Wait, what? You can now do the recycling skip as well? Couldn't you do that before? I am a little bit confused. The game lags every now and then, even though the connection is good. Is that... Wait, so maybe... The technical update was bad. I don't know. For now, for me, it works fine. I don't see any issues. At least on my side, it works fine. How does he have two workbenches? So for those who don't know, you can have more workbenches. Wait, I'm going to get some fuel to power this up. I'm going to get actually two canisters of fuel, and I'm going to show you how I've gotten the second workbench here. So if you do not know, to get the second workbench, you have to work on your settlement. You have to work on this wood shop thing. So... Once you connect everything here, once you connect the pressing machine to water, you will be able to unlock the second sawmill, and that's how I have it. I've already unlocked it, except the game doesn't really show that the sawmill is connected, uh, that the pressing machine is connected to the water pump, but it is connected to the water pump. I just had to activate this other generator, so now here we can get these chipboards, which are pretty expensive. But hey, now... That's it. That's how we were able to unlock this second sawmill. So that's how we get it. Now we could upgrade something else, but nothing else is uh, here anymore. So it's pointless for me to get some more reinforced floors and building the level 5 wall, which is not even in the game. I don't think it's possible to upgrade it. And it says new workbench recipes and furniture are coming soon. Okay. Interesting. Am I really excited for more items in the settlement? I have no idea. It's already pretty difficult to unlock everything in the settlement. Makes no sense you get the second uh, when you almost have everything. Would be useful in the very beginning, so Jessica. Absolutely, 100%. They should add that workbench, maybe not on level 3 woodshop, but at least on level 2 woodshop. Because once you get almost everything, you don't really need it. So that is a little bit silly. But again, lots of the things in last and work backwards. Like, for example, that Bunker Bravo. With Bunker Bravo, you go to the... You unlock your ATV, and to clear Bunker Bravo, you need uh, lead, or you need le uh, hazmat armor that needs lead, or you need anti-rads, and you unlock all of those things in the swamp location. But to get to the swamp location, you need the ATV. But once you get the ATV, you don't need to clear that Bunker Bravo. So some things here do work backwards. Uh, I didn't even need to activate this generator. That's my bad. Well, in any case, I just used one more extra fuel. 
what I wanted to do is get a stack of pine beams and I wanted to start getting more uh, whatever this stuff is called, uh, sawdust, right? I want to get some more sawdust. Because we got to start collecting that sawdust. Once we get a lot of sawdust, we'll be able to start doing other things. As I said, I'm just collecting lots of resources. That's like probably the best way to work on the settlement. If you don't want to grind too much in that settlement, just keep getting a bunch of pine beams and a bunch of iron billets. Those are the staple resources that you'll need. That's it. Who needs logic? Logic is overrated anyway, says Infinity Swift. Hell yeah. It's been a while since I've seen you, Infinity Swift, because I do remember that name. I recognize it. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. It's like, remember Waltz from Dying Light 2? You can get his outfit and grappling hook skins in Nightmare Mode. You have to make a new game, please. Nightmare Mode, says Adam. Maybe one day we'll check out Dying Light 2. Perhaps, perhaps. And the garage. To work on the garage, we need those 40 slates. And then I'll be able to upgrade my minivan to a bit higher level. And then we'll be able to do more expeditions. But again, that's the problem for the future, Sayak. I don't really bother about those expeditions that much. As I said, I'm just gathering the resources, and once I have lots of those resources, maybe I'll be able to just upgrade the garage like that or not. But like every day, bothering and like working on every single workbench, replenishing every single workbench when you don't have the resources for it. Just too much time and pointless. I'll just get a bunch of pine beams and then I'll focus on other workbenches. Think that'll be easier. So, do we do the first raid of the day, ladies and gents? Are you ready to buckle up? Can you do the walking zombie again? Maybe one day we'll check it out. Can't promise anything, as we never know. So we need to kill the blind one and we need to open the blue box of the farm location. Are they reset? I don't know. Probably not, but hey, we can always refresh that stuff now with rations and we have some of them. So let's get ready. Raid time. Yes, indeed, people. Raid time. We are about to do the first raid of the day. Favorite part of the update. Favorite part of the update. I mean, you can now auto clear green zones for watching ads. Which is a nice little addition. Is there anything else, ladies and gentlemen? Have they changed any icons or something? Is there anything else we've noticed? Some of you said that you can have skip on the recycler, but is that true? I don't think before we could do this. Or maybe I'm just getting bamboozled. I think I'm just getting bamboozled, ladies and gentlemen, or maybe I'm not. Oh, they added this thing. You can now skip it. It definitely did not exist before, ladies and gentlemen. So there is another addition to the game. You can now skip in the recycler. How many times we can do this per day? Wait, I'm going to go on the full screen again here. And I'm going to watch another ad, ladies and gentlemen. So now you can skip... You can now skip the... The recycler. By watching an ad. And you can open up. You can loot green zones. The ad is distracting me. It's like Resident Evil knockoff ad. In any case, show us the ad. Guys, I'm not going to show you the ad. The ad's not paying me anything. Why would I show you the ad? Doesn't work like this. I'm not going to promote what the ad is showing here. Ten times a day when you first use it. Ten times a day. You can only use uh, your, uh, your ads to auto-clear green zones only once a day. Or once every like eight or something hours maybe. Uh, there we go. We did it, ladies and gentlemen. We were able to skip this thing by watching an ad. Cool. Can we watch one more ad then? I want to bring another... Whatever that thing is called. Another gun. And... Uh, any other broken guns. There we go. For example, this broken shotgun. Let's see. I'm on iOS and I can't auto-clear green with ads. You have to update the game. Oh, you can uh, auto. You can recycle another gun. Okay, cool. So maybe you can do ten times. Maybe you can recycle like ten items. Okay, cool. But you can only auto clear one zone once every like couple of hours, every eight or something hours. Did you see the last internet ad on Instagram? It starts with a real guy falling off a truck. They're so innovative when it comes to ads. Says why not? I don't know. I don't pay attention to that stuff. I haven't seen that ad. That's what I'm trying to say here. The long story short, I haven't seen that ad. Can't do it, some people say. Okay, you need to update the game. You need to go to Google Play Store or iOS Store, whatever it's called, App Store, and update the game there, and you should be able to do it. So there are two things that were added to the game then. Auto-clearing green zones for watching ads and skipping the recycler. 
by watching an ad. At least that's what's going on here. Um, anything else that I need to bring? A shotgun? So these were like positive little changes. I like it, I guess. Anything else that I need to bring? Wait, that's actually way too many items for that silly farm. Way too many. It's like, can we skip cooking food? I haven't checked it in a long time. I think you could skip that before, but what would you want to skip cooking food? It makes no sense. It takes like five minutes to, to cook that stuff anyway, so it wouldn't make any sense to skip cooking food. I don't even have anything to cook here. They're working on the game and that makes me happy, says Jessica. Absolutely, that makes me happy as well. At least we've gotten something. So I have a machete, I have some guns, and I'm gonna get some healing items and we can get out of here. Oh, like the fish recipe, can you skip the that stuff? Okay, we for that I'll have to cook another recipe. Can we skip the repair station at the VIP? I don't know, I'm not, I don't have the VIP. I don't know if you can skip the VAP by watching it. I mean, no, you wouldn't be able to do this because for the VAP, you need those special coins, the special cap, special currency. It's not going to work. I'm almost sure about that. I'm definitely sure. Why would you be able to skip that with ads? They're definitely not going to let you do that. Okay, let's sort out the silly chopper. So yeah, for the VAP, definitely you're not going to be able to repair guns by watching ads. It wouldn't work that way. For sure. And another... Katana. Maybe I'll get that katana here and whatever. There we go. We are finally ready. What's the update? The update is the update. One of the updates of all time. So now you can use ra you can use ads to skip the recycler. I think you can do that like up to 10 times. But you can also auto clear these green zones by using ads. But there's a cooldown timer. I think you need to wait like 7 hours maybe. Maybe 7 hours and 30 minutes. I don't know, maybe 8 hours. I have no idea. Well, I had to wait like 6 hours and like 20 something minutes or 18 something minutes. So those were the two new things that were added to the game. Wash the bike, angry faces. Guys, I my fa my my bike is washed. I'm gonna say my face is washed. My face is washed, my bike is washed. Don't talk bad about my bike. I got my hopes up for nothing, says Yusuf. I mean the title says the new update is here, but it isn't what you think. So this is the very important update that we're speaking about. Uh, they said... Wait, why am I back here? Is it even reset? Yeah, it is reset. The farm is reset for some reason. It wasn't supposed to be reset today, but whatever. I think this update reset my farm location. Cool. I can do it again. Unless I'm mistaken. Bottle of pee. I'll take it with me. Maybe I can even drop that stuff in the chopper. Your bike isn't washed. It looks ugly. It looks pretty. What do you mean? And the bike is clean. Stop it. Stop talking bad about my bike. If you could, if I could auto wash that bike without getting like five bottles of water, that would be a lot faster. But I have to go back to the base. I gotta get fast five bottles of water to wash the chopper for what? For absolutely nothing. They reset the farm off stream. I did not reset the farm off stream. You can skip uh, bath with ads. Could you do that before? If you can skip the infected bath now to get those infected crates. Wait, every time I kill the raider, the game kind of froze. What about the... 
Okay, this is fine. But every time I kill those raiders, the game kind of froze for a second. Interesting. Okay, so continuing the topic about the updates and whatever. So this wasn't like the important update. They said that there is an important technical update. Or whatever they call it. So yes, this was this update. But they said that we're not going to get anything during this update. However, we did get something. Now we can skip green zones with ads and the recyclers with ads. But in May, we're going to get another update. And they've actually shared a sneak peek. Wait, I'm going to quickly deal with these rotten yokels. And this is not the efficient way to clear the farm. I have to repeat that. If you want to know how to clear the farm, type Happy Cyric Farm Guide. And there will be a video on how to clear the farm efficiently. This is not how you clear it efficiently. But we have gotten another sneak peek here from the devs. And it's the Boren Trap. Sounds like a great name for a tavern. So it looks like maybe they'll, they'll add a tavern during the seven-year anniversary of LDOE. Probably it'll be just a temporary event. But remember, both of our guests you're going to meet in May are extremely dangerous and are uh, unforgiving when you make mistakes. Stay alert. Big emote. Yeah, yeah, very cool. So, they've shown the bear trap. Maybe they'll add it permanently to the game. Currently, the bear trap requires... Where is it? Will I find it? It should be somewhere here-ish. Currently, the bear trap requires tungsten. I mean, we've checked it today during the stream. But just in case those that haven't seen the other yeah, bear trap requires tungsten, but developers have explicitly said like a couple of days ago that the May will not have the helicopter. The May update won't have the helicopter and the tungsten. So if there is a bear trap, they'll change the recipe. There's no way they'll add tungsten. Especially when they explicitly said that they were not adding tungsten and the helicopters uh, during the May update. Now they have almost everything skippable with that. Surely they can make the game less pay to win, says DA. Nah, that wouldn't work that way. Which again, I said many times already, this game doesn't really have a lot of pay to win features. I mean, ATV is kind of pay to win-ish, but it's silly. Anyways, a lot of the good stuff in the game, like guns, for example, you can get them for free. Whoops. Right? The things that you can buy in this game are pretty useless. Like, you can get puppies. You can probably buy Rottweiler puppies, but they're kind of low-key useless. It's cool if you'll get it. If It's cool if you'll do whatever. Rottweiler puppy is great. It can do, like, double the damage than the normal puppy. Blah, blah, blah. But a good luck getting it. Also, the ATV. ATV is cool. To get those ATV transmissions, you need to pay for the season passes, or you gotta get lucky by spinning caps, or you can get them now from the transport hub, if you're lucky. But ATV isn't that great. So luckily still, a lot of the things in this game are obtainable by just grinding. Well, besides the ATV, ATV is pretty difficult to obtain without without paying, because you need 10 ATV transmissions, and good luck getting those. Maybe with the transport up now, it's a bit easier, but the drop rates of those ATV transmissions are pretty low. The question goes to you, to those that are grinding those ATV transmissions from the transport hub, have you gotten any ATV transmissions from the transport hub? If you're trying to get them, and if you're trying to assemble your ATV, because I've opened up those uh, two crates in the transport hub that give you ATV transmissions, and I've gotten zero ATV transmissions so far. I got so many Rottweiler dogs from the season pass, and they're all girls. Yup. I did have some Rottweiler dogs from the season pass as well, and I still do not have my true friend, Rottweiler Doggo. Doggos are a bit weird. Like, the entire true friend Doggo system is weird. If they were a bit more common, I think that'd be better. So also guys, wall tricking still works, but if you stay here in one place, they will move. So now you have to keep moving. You have to let them attack you here, and then you have to stay there. Otherwise, they will move. So the those changes, the wall trick changes have occurred at the farm like a couple of months ago. Maybe half a year ago. It's been a while, maybe even a year ago. I don't know, time's a blur. By gods, for gods, says DA. Yes, sir. This game is made by gods, 
or gods. I played for six years and I still don't have the true friend Dogo says Hitia uh, Andre. Well, hopefully you'll get it. I got very lucky with my true friend Doggo. And I don't really even use it that much because it isn't that good. The point is... If the true friend Doggo was a lot easier to get, it would be a lot better. The... If you get that true friend Doggo when you're like level 209, when you're already max level, when you already have a bunch of items in your base, it's not really that useful. It can be useful if you bring it, like, let's say, to Bunker Alpha, like, to help you out with some zombies. It's cool. It can definitely save you some items, but when you've progressed in this game a lot already, then the true friend Doggo is uh, useful. And you unlock that Doggo when you kind of don't need it anymore. Unless they add, like, special events for the true friend Doggo, then maybe cool, but... Yeah, maybe if they add, like, a location, maybe add the transport hub. That you can loot with the true friend Doggo and it has a chance to give you ATV transmissions. Then the true friend Doggo's value would, like, skyrocket. Then it would be even better. But as of right now, the true friend Doggo is just, like, random. But then it would be kind of unfair. Then the true friend Doggo would be even more pay-to-win than it is right now. So, I don't know, man. I don't know. Let's deal with the right Yoko and let's open up that blue box. It's like it's still not working to auto clear green zones on Android, and I updated the game. I have no idea why you can't up uh, why you can't auto clear it. I can auto clear it. Some people in the chat can also auto clear it, but I don't know why you can't do it. I have no idea. Try to message the support, I guess. I have no clue. Maybe not everybody got that feature, but that would make no sense. Oh, I haven't booted this. I'm a donut. Whatever, let's get a spread shot. Let's get this. And now let's deal with all these zombies. Oh, I'm gonna get hit in the face, of course. Why wouldn't I get hit in the face? Okay, now I'll only have a couple of Savage Giants and that's about it. Like, what, only four Savage Giants? And then we're done. Okay, let's deal with these Savage Giants just so that I can progress. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait, 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 do we have the supply event? Yes, I do have the supply event. I didn't mean to get the white paint. Or maybe I didn't mean to get the white paint. There you go, now I can kill these Savage Giants and at least progress a bit in that supply event. Should have gotten the rewards from the supply event before starting this farm, but hey, I've just remembered about that supply event. So it's better late than never. It's like make series on the crater. It's not that interesting. That's why I haven't done anything about the crater. Not a lot of people really play in the crater. It hasn't gotten any updates in a long time. And, uh, Engine parts. Uh, I'm gonna bring those engine parts back to the base. You know why? Because when, not if, ladies and gentlemen, but when we will get the helicopter, I'm sure we will require a lot of those engine parts. We'll need a couple of hundred of those engine parts. I'm sure about that. So that's why I'm collecting those engine parts, ladies and gentlemen. And yes, I said that without my clown wig. The store has removed the resuscitators for shopping resuscitator <laughs> resuscitator who refers to these reanimators as resuscitators wait you can no longer buy resuscitators bruh those were the only things that i kind of bought in this game like my last five purchases are probably from like two or three years ago and they were the reanimators they removed reanimators from the store the only good thing that was in the store kind of why I am very confused. Well, at least you can still buy the dogs, am I right? At least we can buy doggos. Whatever, they removed something from the store, that means the game is getting less pay to win, so whatever. Those reanimators were cheap, though. You could get, like, what, five reanimators for, like, two dollars or something? 
no helicopters. We won the trolley. We will get everything. We'll get the helicopters. We'll get the trolleys. We'll get everything. Yo, Red444, welcome to the stream. Sack, your passion for YouTube is amazing. It's been around six, seven years since you started the channel and you're still grinding. Keep it up, says Red. I've started the channel nine, almost 10 years ago, but welcome to the stream. Glad to see you here. Glad that you're enjoying the videos. Um, let's drop the tickets here. Wait, and have other locations reset as well? Or did only farm reset today? I have no idea. We won the submarine. Maybe we will get that submarine. Maybe we, maybe we will. Maybe we will. So soon, maybe tomorrow. Probably tomorrow I'll release a video talking about the updates that they removed from the game. And I wish they didn't. I want those updates to actually come back to the game because those updates were phenomenal. And I just remember that I forgot to talk about the Echo site uh, update where you had to defend the those echo machines not the echo machine there were like some sort of a drill it would it was making noise and zombies would attack you you'd have to like play spike traps and you'd have to fight zombies the the only like unique concepts only unique updates are getting removed from the game i don't get it we had that echo site thing whatever it could have been the settlement that's what they could have done that echo site could have been like the settlement instead of these expeditions that would have been a lot better but they removed it the prison was cool yes in that video I do talk about the prison it's, it's insane how all the good and unique updates. I'd even say creative updates got removed. And I know that maybe those updates didn't have like the best rewards. But just because the update doesn't have good rewards doesn't mean that the update was bad. Like just improve the rewards and that's it. People will play those updates because those updates were great. <sighs> so I'm very disappointed. So it's like we've never had any good updates. We've had a decent amount of good updates in last generation. It's just that a lot of those updates were removed. For some whatever reason, Fort Must was the best. Even Fort Must was amazing. And yes, I did talk about the Fort Must in that video. Fort Must was sick. It also was very... It was a creative update. It was very unique. You had to, like, build up walls. You had to defend the, the, the waves. You had to kill the zombies. You had to upgrade, like, the turrets. Uh, defending the, the, the tower, the radio tower, or whatever. It was sick. But not anymore. The purple chewing gum event. Yes, yes, yes. The purple chewing gum event. Yes. Again, maybe rewards were bad from that event. Usually I don't... When I think of events, I don't really think about the rewards. Because the rewards are the easiest to fix in this game. Just get, just give better rewards. If the event is bad because of the rewards, do not do not remove the event. Add better rewards and that's it. That chewing gum event. Maybe the rewards were not perfect because that event was kind of expensive. Just give us better rewards and that's it. But hey. So that's what's sad about. That, that's what's the most sad about Last Earth because it's not like they haven't released updates. They have released a lot of updates when you think about it. Throughout the six years, we've had an insane amount of temporary content but if all that temporary content was permanent content like right now last night would be would have way more content than it has uh that was good at first but then the increased chewing gum cost uh, with patch and broke it yep but again they only broke the rewards the update itself was fun the 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 content the 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 event itself was great in any case, let's talk to the raiders and let's see what other tasks we gotta do before we start another raid. We can finally skip stuff with ads in the settlement. Wait, is that true? Bruh, is that true? Then that's another change. That is another change, ladies and gentlemen. Because we couldn't skip anything in the settlement before. Let's see if I can skip stuff here. Oh yeah, we can skip stuff in the settlement as well. Absolutely epic. So now there are three changes then. You can skip the green zones. Once every like six, seven or whatever hours, maybe more, I have no idea. You can skip the recycler and you can skip the stuff in the settlement now. Which is... Cool. I guess. So, hey, there's that. So this update did have some changes. Yeah, yeah. Can I get my daily rewards? Nope, still have to wait 25 more minutes. Like, maybe the capture 
thing, the evacuation thing, could have like similar style to the Fort Moss event. They could add like some sort of a Fort Moss event to the settlement. Like that, that'd be amazing. Why not? Or the Echo Site event, whatever it was called. What do you mean we can skip green zones? You can auto clear green zones by watching ads once every six, seven hours or something. I, I don't know how many hours you have to wait. I had to wait six hours and like 18 or something minutes. Or uh, six hours and 15 minutes. I don't know. So there's that. Um, we've recycled one gun. We have to kill the blind one. Wait, wait, let's start recycling another gun. Let's recycle two of these guns. Maybe let's recycle them later. Let's just kill the blind one now. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's what we're gonna do. Let's get the shotties. Let's get this broken Glock. We have the broken gun that I'll recycle now. And yeah, as you can see, we can now watch ads and recycle things by watching ads. So I don't really know why they made a post saying that, hey, you know what? The new update is out. But we didn't add anything new, but they, in fact, did add something. But I mean, how would they say that? Like, hey, we added the ability to... To skip things with ads. Now we can skip more things with ads. I don't know. In any case. Mm. Let's get... A scythe. I'm taking way too many items here. And I'm gonna get a couple of grenades. They put more ads because they need more money, says Equal. Uh, why can. Who doesn't? In this day and age, or in whatever day and age, who doesn't need more money? Show me a person. And again, it's not like I'm trying to defend the devs or whatever. I'm just saying that saying stuff like the sky is blue isn't really anything. It's, it's kind of obvious. But yeah, out of all the changes that I could have done, it's like one of the... Uh, one change that kind of benefits the players as well. So as you can see, guys, you can skip the green zones. That's what I was talking about. Out of all the like kind of pay to win whatever changes they could have done, this one was... Uh, at least useful for the free-to-play players. Gonna put ads in my chat messages, says DA. Interesting. Speaking of ads, like one day uh, we will have the VR headsets and uh, you'll be playing a game and you'll get an ad and those VR headsets will be tracking your eye movement and you won't be able to skip that ad and the ad won't play unless you're like uh, explicitly look at that ad because they'll see if you're looking at it if you don't look at it the timer won't go or wherever you look they'll just like pop that ad there if you close your eyes the timer won't go and speaking of it doesn't matter of what there we go ladies and gentlemen we have the smiley face here smash like smash subscribe for the smiley face and thank you for the password jessica thank you thank you for the password 4486 uh, 44873 44873 there we go but skipping only 10 times is pretty mad. Back then, we can watch ads for unlimited times. Okay, then it is pretty mad. Dude, we didn't get any new updates. We get basically nothing. We are trying to find gold in... 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 In human waste here, basically. You can watch ads. Obviously, it's not a thing. Amazing. I'm not trying to sit here and pretend that, hey, this was the best update that we've gotten. Basically, this update does not exist and they did not add anything new to this update. But I'm just trying to be at least like low-key, kind of a little bit positive. Hey, let's start the third floor. I got you, sorry. Thank you. Thank you for sharing the password. I was ready to go on Discord and find it, but thank you. Also, guys, if you're not on Discord, you can join our Discord. Discord.gg slash happy Cyric. Or link is down in the description. Can we put random number? Random number what? Can you put random number for what? I should have gotten a floppy crate. We can definitely open up a floppy crate today. I just have to either go back to the top and get green and 
yellow tickets or I have to bring those yellow tickets from the base. So please remind me today to get that floppy crate because I think we can open it up. Yes. It's like, what's your opinion by the thing I said? Okay, wait, let me go back up there. There are just a couple of people here waiting for you, but it's okay. I'll find your chat. Don't worry, people don't need me to grind here. I'll find a chat. Can you see if you get a stack of items and watch and add it? Recycle 20 items or one? I'll read it again slower. Can you see if you get a stack of items and watch and add it? Recycle 20 items or one? It will recycle one item. I don't even need to test that, but thank you. Like if you add 20 batteries, basically, will it? The dude is asking if you add 20 batteries, will it recycle one battery or 20 batteries? It'll recycle one battery. Not that comment. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know which comment to find. I apologize. I have to find another comment. Interesting. In any case, guys, we're going to start the hard mode. We're going to kill the zombies there. Then we'll kill the blind one. We'll do the nade trick because why not? And, uh, yeah. Then we can do the first raid of the day. I used to watch you about five years ago, says Ernestas. You... Uh, loving the progress you made with your YouTube career. Absolutely deserve it, man. Love from Lithuania. Uh, thanks, Ernestas. Thank you, thank you. Sveikas. Glad to see you here. I'm glad that you're enjoying the videos. Very cool. What's for dinner, says Wanda? The same thing as yesterday. Or to make it more fancy, as you guys, as sometimes people say, like, I'll, I'll say, I'll, I'll usually eat, like, pasta or quinoa. Uh, then I'll have eggs. I'll have, like, maybe something else. But this time I'll just say, I'll have eggs. Wait, what? How was I able to sneak that dude? Did I just find a new glitch? If you sneak attack fast enough, if you attack them and you sneak attack, that, that, is that a glitch? Did I break the game? Am I gonna get banned for it? Developers, if you're watching it, please don't ban me. God damn it. What did I do? And now I have to test it out. What if I... I think there is something in it. I think there is something. It's not the first time that it happened. I don't think it's during this update. I think it happened before in the transport up as well. If you sneak attack fast enough... Interesting. Whatever, let's kill these zombies. Yeah, that glitch I did like twice as well. Yeah, yeah, some, uh, I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one that has done that glitch then. Double sneak attack works and it can be done consistently. Hell yeah. Double sneak attack glitch. My favorite glitch. Glitch wall trick. Forget about wall trick. Double sneak attack. That's what I'm talking about. Developers have added a new update. Now you can sn double sneak attack. It's not a glitch, it's a feature, says Infinity Swift. How would I know that it's not a feature exactly? Maybe it is a feature. Maybe it is. What's playing in the headphones today? Uh, I'm not really sure. Mad City? What's the update, says Jose? Welcome to the stream. Nothing really was added new in this update, but now you can skip uh, the... You can auto-clear green zones once with rations. You can skip the stuff in the recycler, and you can skip stuff with ads in the settlement. There we go. Last in our jungle music. Um, I'll get this. Um, shotguns. There we go. We gotta get the shotty. Back we had, back in the days, we had a very sick glitch when you would sneak attack and you could let it just like, yeah, probably sneak attack and shoot like basically infinitely fast. Infinitely fast. Does that even make any sense? It does make sense. 
ridiculously fast. You could shoot ridiculously fast, basically, just by sneak attacking. You could kill, like, this blind one in one go. Still no craft uh, X10 update. Yeah, but how many times do you need to craft that many bandages? It would be a nice quality of life, like, improvement. I definitely feel like they should add it anyways. But, like, would you ever need to craft 10 boots? No. So maybe they shouldn't even add that feature. It would be nice to, like, craft 10 bandages at the same time. Or 10 first aid kits at the same time. But if you could craft, like, 10 boots at the same time, people would accidentally craft more boots than they need. They would use up all of the resources on that feature, so... I don't even know if they should add it. If they add it, they should add it only to the bandages and, like, first aid kits. Otherwise, me and a bunch of other people will waste the resources. Or auto-sort everything to your base. Yep, that update would be amazing. The auto-sort everything in the base. Basically, that update would take your loot from your backpack and drop it inside of your chests. That would be sick. That's the update that we need. You are late, says Matthew. Excuse me, just joined. We're 45 minutes in. And you just joined and I am late? Sorry, excuse me. Today I was earlier than last time. I think yesterday I've started the live stream at this time. And I'm already live streaming here, so hey, I'm not late. Take those words back. Yeah, they'll probably add it to stackable items. Yep. I mean, yeah, first aid kits, anti-rad pills, bandages, crafting 10 C4 at the same time. Imagine 200 steel just disappears. Okay, we are done with the blind one. Now, let's just clear the third floor fully. Why not? We'll get some points towards the season. We have five more days left, and soon we'll be able to get one more Dragunov. Will I be able to sneak attack this thing again? How did I... I'm not sure how am I supposed to sneak attack so that I can do double sneak attack. I'm sure I'm doing something wrong, though. It's almost a given. What's the update recap, says Matthew? Uh, I've said that many times already. Wait, let me gather my energy. So, you can now auto-clear green zones with ads. You can do it once every couple of hours. Now, didn't mean to get these exploders. Thanks, Matthew. I blame you. And you can skip stuff in the recycler by watching ads and you can skip stuff in the settlement by watching ads thought I'll die there Zubat says Psyrek play something else for real says Zubat maybe thanks for the suggestion really cool really cool Zubat that's not how it works, Zubad. But I also I wanted to play Fallout 4, kinda. But then I've learned that there will be the Fallout 4 uh, next gen update on April 26th or something like that. I'm not really sure about the date, but the, the end of April. So I wanted to check that out. But then I've learned that there are a bunch of copyrighted music and you can't really turn it off, so I think forget about it. Last on Earth 2 is on the way. Yes, I'm very excited for Last on Earth 2. The devs are in trap of sorts. New players bring most money, but content for new players is useless. For everyone else, 99% of players don't even have ATV. It's useless to add ATV content, for example, says Parvel, uh, Meltrom. Absolutely. Yeah. That's why we haven't gotten lots of new updates here, because it's a lot... Probably better for them to create new games to work on something else than work on Last on Earth when most of their revenue has already been gotten from Last on Earth. But I also believe that they get lots of money from old players as well. I'm not sure, I guess. I mean, I would only assume that they also get a significant part of that money. Oh, I was able to sneak attack this guy twice. 
So I get it, it's probably not beneficial for them to add new stuff for the for the ATV. New content for the ATV, I get it, but at the same time they're not adding anything new at all, so they might as well add something for the old players if they're not adding anything to new players anyways. And my armor is going to break. Absolutely. Uh, let's go to equipment. Let's get something, I don't know, like the tactical set. So if they had to prioritize like new players and old players, I don't know. I think they have to balance it out. Long story short, I think they have to balance it out. They should definitely focus on new players, but they should also focus on old players as well. Because a new player is just a new player. Like, there are lots of things in this game. They definitely want players to play this game for a long time. But the game gets a lot more difficult once you assemble the chopper. Luckily, now they've added the transporter, which is, I think, was the missing link in this game. So the transport up now allows you to grind a little bit further. Like with the transport up, it's easier now. It's another goal that you got to do. It's another vehicle. If the drone is a vehicle, you got to unlock the drone. So there are more things that you got to do. But once you unlock the drone, then the game kind of stops because you have to get your ATV. But ATV isn't really that cool. There isn't that much motivation. So you should try something like Rust. I've played on the channel. I have like probably a dozen live streams, if not more. Make sure to check it out. Go to the playlist. Go to the channel and go to playlist. I'm sure you'll find a game that you'd like to see. There, there are plenty of games that I've made here on the channel. Plenty of other games that I've played here on the channel. I think I'm ready to start. Yeah, I'm ready. Could get the roll perk, but that roll perk will in no way load up in time, so I won't even bother about it. You should roar, says the A. Stop it. Sir, stop it. So we shouldn't get stuck now in that room because we have killed both of these toxic spitters. And if you don't want to get stuck in that room, then killing both of these toxic spitters is very, very helpful. Like, for example, here, all we have to do now is go like this. And there we go. Now we're not going to get stuck. And yeah, sometimes those toxic spitters can also chase after you and you can get stuck. So yeah, killing those two toxic spitters isn't that difficult. They have like, what, 200 health combined. And it decreases your chances of getting stuck there. So yeah, I'd probably advise you to kill those two toxic spitters. And pre-open the doors. And you shouldn't get stuck in that room unless you like really mess it up. Or you get like very unlucky. Almost got stuck there because of that stupid toxic spitter. That would have been sad. Let's gather these zombies here. And if I had the rolling park, I could just roll here. Whoops. Wait, everything's fine now. Everything is all right, ladies and gents. It's like, do you play mobile games? Not really. Okay, let's hide here and let's wait now for all of these zombies to come. And we are gonna explode them with the sneaky, with the with the grenades, not with the sneaking skill. Today I did my first grenade trick, and where I died and lost everything and succeeded after my fourth attempt. Very nice. I'm glad that you succeeded. I'm sure you've definitely learned a lot. So to those that have just joined and are curious about what we've gotten new in this update, so now you can auto clear green zones at least once a day by watching ads. Instead of using rations, you can still use rations, but now you can uh, watch ads to clear green zones, like the green stone zone and the green wood zone. You can also now watch ads to skip stuff in the recycler before you couldn't do that, and you can watch ads to skip things in the settlement. So there we go. What changed your mind about this trick before you hated doing it? What changed my mind about this trick? Uh, people like this trick a lot. So that was like the main reason, kinda. And it's fun now to do it. And before I always thought the developers will remove it. I 
didn't really care about it that much. So I didn't bother about the strike. I didn't bother to learn something that I thought developers will will remove from the game. And people have kind of like kind of forgotten about the strike. They stopped talking about it. But then all of a sudden, like during every live stream, every video, people would just bombard with this like grenade trick in the toilet thing. So I was like, whatever. I caved in, and I think it's pretty fun. Like I actually enjoy it. I think that's it. We've gotten all of the zombies. Okay. Let's just drop the zombie. Eh, the grenade, not the zombie. Here we need to drop four nades. One. Two. Three. And four. Sometimes those grenades will damage you, so be careful. If you get damaged, then just go back up and you will throw the rest of those grenades. Same thing with the wall trick. Here's some Cyrix story. When when I played last turn, right? I've been playing this game like almost since the very beginning. I've been playing it now for like six years. For over six years. And uh, a lot of people started doing wall trick. I was usually against the wall trick because I thought they'll kind of patch it. And there were people that couldn't do the wall trick. And at that time, everybody did that wall trick. So I didn't want to do the wall trick because why well, care about that wall trick? Everybody already does that. So I wanted to do something else. So I always like cleared the bond corral with either bows or like sneaking with the saw blade mace. And like killing them with, with guns. You could still profit that way. But then they kind of messed it up. Now it's a lot more difficult to sneak attack those frenzy giants. You can still sneak attack them, but you have to stay in the perfect spot. But yeah, long story short, it takes some time for me to adapt. Uh, for me to accept those, like, whatever tricks. Except there's that trick at the farm where you empty your chopper and you kill those zombies by blocking the, 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 the road of the farm. I'll probably do it one day. But I just don't think it's that epic. It's like you should play other games, says Zubad. Zubad, I already told you this and I'll repeat it again. Go to the channel. Oh, I'm gonna just show it. Because Zubat might be like, Psych, I don't understand anything. Uh, here. Here, Zubat. You can go to playlist. And mobile, it'll look a little bit different. But you can go to playlist. And you can find lots of other games here. Icarus. Uh, the Long Dark. Scum. Grounded. The Infected. Conan Exiles. Miss Survival. Daisy, Far Cry Primal. The Last Sand Aftermath, State of Decay, God of War, we haven't finished in any case, Subnautica, Resident Evil, The Walking Zombie 2, Dismantle. There are lots of other playlists, there are lots of other games here on the channel that we have played here. The Durango, there are like some older live streams, uh, older videos, so make sure to check it out, Zubad. There you go. Hopefully now that answered your question. If it didn't, I'll repeat it again. There are hundreds. Other videos on the channel. Non last internet videos. And it's still not enough for Zuba. Zuba is like psych play Minecraft with pants. It doesn't matter. I'm just showing you like hundreds of videos, like probably half a thousand videos, even more than that. Maybe there are like a thousand videos, a thousand non last internet videos. Still not enough. Play Minecraft with the fans. There is Minecraft on the channel as well. I have played Minecraft. Most of the games probably, if it's a survival game, just type on YouTube like Happy Psych and that game. I, I, Chances are I have probably played it. Maybe not. I haven't played every single survival game, but I've played definitely a lot of them. In any case, let's drop now these things here. And we could almost get this floppy crate. All I need to do is get some yellow crates. I just feel like he wants you to become a doctor or a painter or something, maybe. Perhaps. Three parts of Day Are Survival, not anymore now. Yep, I have played Day Are Survival in the past. Doesn't mean that I have to keep playing Day Are every single day. Till the day I die.
don't play don't starve together i have played uh, don't starve on the channel as well i think i have a video on it just because i don't have like 300 videos on a certain game that you guys want me to play because that wouldn't be possible to make 300 videos on every single game ever but there is a video on don't starve okay i don't have any food do I need food? Whatever. I'll need to go back to the base. We could use green uh, red tickets. Uh, where do I store those tickets? Not here. Wait, the tickets gotta be up. No, where do I store my tickets? I definitely have just seen a bunch of red tickets. Oh, there we go. Here they are. Couldn't open that middle crate. I mean, probably that's not gonna be enough. I definitely need more yellow tickets from the base. I can't find the finale of the God of War series, says Matthew. Sadly, there is no finale. As I said, I've never finished that series. Th that's the only series that I regret that I haven't finished because I kind of finished everything else. Because lots of other games either don't have endings or whatever, especially survival games. It's like we need 300 videos on every game you play. No, you don't. I promise you, you don't need 300 videos on every game. Okay, let's get ready to do another raid also I've already mentioned this but there's a smiley face I'll keep saying that all the time the smiley face will take over the world make a video on Brawl Stars I've played Brawl Stars on the channel already might even have live streams on it I'm not sure probably okay let's go back to the base I want to go back and open up the floppy crate. Should we do it? We should definitely do it, and then we should do a raid. And the ATV transmission. Hell yeah. Play, have you played Stardew Valley? Okay, so that game I haven't played. I haven't played Stardew Valley on the channel. Once human, I have a few videos on Once human, and there will be more. I have a few live streams and a video. Maybe two videos. I don't know. There will be more Once human content. Either once the game comes out, or or even before that. Uh, let's get some... Wait, maybe I have already a few... Oh, I already have two of these floppy crates. Okay, so I don't even need more. Hell yeah, let's go to Bunker Alpha and let's open up that floppy crate. Play Genshin Impact. Nope, haven't played that game on the channel. There might be lots of games that I've played, but I haven't played Genshin Impact or that Stardew Valley. Why did you make turrets? Says Sofian to 830. Sofian to 830. Thanks for asking the real questions. I don't know, because I thought the turrets are epic and they turned out not to be epic. Uh, let's go to Bunker Alpha. My farm was reset today after the update, magically, somehow. So, see, I brought mine to my farm location got reset as well. Maybe they did some changes inside of the farm location. I don't think so. Everything is still the same. I've just cleared it. So, there's that. There is that. Okay, let's go back. You already know what's up. What's up inside of the laboratory. Inside of the bunker alpha. I remember when Sari got mad when turrets couldn't kill raiders. I do not remember that, but it sounds something that I would do. Sounds something that I would get mad about. Because why on earth those turrets wouldn't shoot raiders? Back in the days, you could kill those raiders and you could get three, C uh, three VSSs. Now you get nothing. Has anyone killed raiders recently? Like in the past like couple of weeks, months? Maybe at least in the last like year, maybe this year or something. Have you killed those three raiders? If you don't pay the raiders, they will attack your base. Like in two or three hours. And if you've done that, do they give anything? Is it worth it to kill them? Because I kind of want to do it again. Uh, there we go. There's the floppy crate. Let's go. I remember when Sack said rock or die. It wasn't me who said rock or die. It was during one... 
uh, yeah, it was doing some, it was doing a Rust live stream. I got stuck in a, uh, in like some sort of an outpost. And a guy told me that I won't be able to leave the outpost unless he gives me a, unless I give him my rock. So he said rock or die. Are you going to play Westland Survival anymore? I don't think so. Maybe. It's like, play some horror games. We have played some horror games on the channel already. Maybe there will be more. We played all the Resident Evil games. Most of them, kind of. The remakes. I didn't know you played Rust. Uh, do have lots of live streams. And some videos on it. If you haven't checked out Rust content, make sure to check it out. There will be maybe more Rust content. Like one, oh, there will be an infected crate. No, whatever. It's been a while since I've had that infected crate. Might as well just bring it back to the base. I think one, one day I'll just do like a rust week or something. And I'll just grind rust for an entire week. That way I'll be able to properly grind rust, but we'll see. Have you ever heard of kitchen simulator? Disappointed. Stop it. Watch another ad. I cannot watch one more ad here. Need to wait five more hours unless that's not the ad you're talking about that I'm confused. Have you done a video about the mods for your guns? Yes, type Happy Cyric LDOE mods and there will be a video about the mods. The acid bath ad. Oh, the acid bath ad. Okay, cool. Should have clarified it. Okay, we're gonna bring the chopper. What oh, couldn't turn for some reason? leave the chopper here. Now I need to empty this acid bath, which is going to be a pain. I too myself wonder if you'll sometime maybe play Kitchen Simulator. The more I read those comments, the, the more I acknowledge them, the, the worse it is for me. Why do I do this? Why am I so stupid? Now let's quickly sort out at least my inventory. The first thing I see after updating a $100 offer for garage level 3 with new graphics. Oh yeah, I've seen that offer as well. I don't think I can show it as well, but it does look different. That offer does look different. Hell yeah, so we need to now take all of these things. I need to drop them somewhere in the chest, but... I don't have any more space. I don't think I will be able to open up that acid bath, ladies and gents. Maybe I will be. Somehow, some way. It'd be nice if we had two acid baths. I mean, it still wouldn't be enough. Both of those acid baths would be full. Still not enough. Why do I have these level one hatches? Whatever, I'll craft more later. Doesn't matter. Oh my god, take all the wood. I would sell my family for that wood. As I said many times, I'm glad I'm not your family then. Because I wouldn't want to be sold for a stone hatchet. At least an iron hatchet, maybe. But a stone hatchet is pretty sad. Are we going to walk like dogs today? Maybe. Maybe we will. Last time we have unlocked some new items in the supermarket simulator, so maybe we will work like dogs today. I'll delete this. I'll try to find space for jerky. How do I have that much of it? That's it. I cannot store anything else. No, I'll store this. 
Um, I need to now find space for the pills. How on earth don't they fit? Make room in your warehouse, maybe. I'm gonna get rid of... I don't even know what. We have four aluminum. Get out of here. There we go. Yeet those spills. I'm not gonna yeet them. We don't really need them. I should probably just yeet them. By yeet, I mean like not like eat, but like yeet to get rid of them. Well, now the acid bath is empty, ladies and gents. So let's get this infected box. When Resident Evil come out, what do you think? I have no idea when it'll come out. Don't have a slightest clue. Uh, we need an air filter. Wait, I do have air filters in another place. Hey, I store some air filters inside of this box. Hell yeah. Let's get one air filter and we need three acid. Let's add these things, and I think now you should be able to... There we go, you can now skip this thing by watching ads as well. So let's watch an ad uh, for this, and let's see what's up. And let's skip the acid bath. So that's also another new thing that was added in this new update. Can maybe show the sneak peek of the ad, guys, just a little bit. They said that was enough. That was enough. You're not gonna see more of that ad. You're definitely not gonna see more of it. Show the ad. That was just a just a short sneak peek. That's it. That's enough, ladies and gentlemen. That was nice. It says reward granted, but yet I still have to. I can't close it. Lol, awesome ad. That's it. That was the sneak peek of the ad. Ladies and gentlemen, that is it. Where's the box? Oh, the box is here. Hell yeah. <laughs> what do we have? 2C4. Sadly, no grenade launchers, but hey, we've got a 2C4, so... I'll take it. I will take it. Now let's drop the stuff back inside of the acid bath, and let's try to sort out whatever we've just got in here. So that was another thing, guys, that they've added during this update. Now we can skip Acid Bath with ads. Which is cool! I guess before you had to wait an hour, now you can just get it instantly, that's... I mean, it's weird to say that it's a step in the right direction, Like now we can watch more ads. Like, I don't know, that sounds weird, but hey, whatever, it's better than nothing, that's what I'll say. The more ads we have in this game, the more it'll feel like, hey, it's one of those games that has ads plastered everywhere, but as long as these ads don't pop up uh, without your consent, I think it's fine. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, where do I even store the C4s here, maybe? Okay, let's drop them. Oh, we did get a scar, though, from that place. That's cool. Um, what else do I need to do? I think we're done with everything. We can finally do the first raid of the day. Uh, just need to recycle two more guns. I'm absolutely okay with the way they put ads in Lies and Earths as Northern Zombie. Yep. Again, it is a slippery slope. But... Yeah, I've played mobile games in the past, and some ads in those games are ridiculous. They're very annoying. And Last on Earth ads are not annoying. Like it's it's probably the only mobile game where people where uh, where people are upset that you don't have more ads here. So I guess they're doing something good. I think the way they're adding ads is is the right way. Probably I agree with that. You get things for watching ads. Like one ad here. 
You can use 17 coins, like whatever that would cost to use 17 coins. Let's say we're going to recycle this thing. It's 20 coins, ladies and gentlemen. You can buy 20 coins. You can buy 50 coins for 239. This is like $1, basically. One ad is like uh, almost like $1. Kind of not really, just very like quick uh, math done on one knee. But yeah, like $1 basically per skip. Kind of, not really, but you got the point. Kind of pog. So it's not like... Maybe if we didn't have that uh, skip with coins option, then ads would feel maybe more intrusive because like, hey, just watch the ads to skip things. But it's like now you know that uh, you can either buy things or watch an ad. I don't know. In any case, it's not bad. Recycle a propeller, it gives titanium. Why would I want to recycle a uh, that propeller? Why do you spam that in the chat? I'm very confused. Why do you write in caps? I'm even more confused. Oh, it's the same person now. I know what's up. Okay, cool. I was confused who was writing that. Then I read the name. I'm like, oh, okay. They're all, that person, you know who I'm talking to. You're already tre treading on a very... On thin ice. Be careful. Keep spamming. And you'll be banned. Oh my god, Cyric, please don't ban me. I wonder if we can watch ads for the settlement workbenches. Yes, we can watch ads for the settlement workbenches now. Absolutely. And now I do not know where to store my propeller. Thanks. For absolutely nothing. Ban me, Cyric. Says Wana. Nobody's getting banned. Have you heard of Last Dinner? Nope, haven't heard of it. Maybe one day I'll check it out. Can you make a video on how to clear Bunker Alpha? Yes, check out everything you need to know about Last Generate. Link is in the description. Check out the... The free-to-play playlist. And uh, the video that I've done recently, the easiest and fastest way to get rich and whatever. Like, check out those videos, like, and you'll learn everything. Basically, start from everything you need to know about LDOE. Um, we are ready to do the raid. Let's get this. Uh, I'm gonna get a couple of hatchets. Oh no, I haven't sorted out this place yet. No. Well, I'm just gonna bring hatchets back to that acid bath. That's all I keep. I should only keep hatchets inside of that acid bath. I shouldn't keep anything else. That's it. I got an idea, let's have a new game search. Your stuff playlist in your crate, what? Let's have a new game search, your stuff playlist in your crate. I'm very confused what that's supposed to mean, but hey. <laughs> what a good idea, if it was supposed to be funny. If it was supposed to be serious, then it's a very good idea, I like it. If it was something sad, then I'm sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm sad to hear that. So pick the reaction you like. Because I have no clue what you tried to say there. But I, I gave all of the reactions that you might ever need. Uh, where is the food? Probably up here. And also, a couple of days ago, I had an idea, ladies and gents, that hey, maybe we do not get lots of new updates. But I can update my own base. I can reorganize these boxes. I can move, like, chests to another, like, room or whatever. And then the game will feel fresh again. Hmm? It's kind of annoying that you cannot move these walls. It's very silly that we cannot pick these walls up and move them wherever we want. That would be so much better. But I... Let's get a C4 and I'm ready to roll. I don't think there's anything else I need. Let's go. And yo, Insane, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. I did send you a telepathic hello and you responded to it. I'll say it out loud.
Wait, where's my chopper? Oh, it's up there. Can you play a game where you promised a helicopter, but don't actually get to use it? Is this casual gaming guides? Are you talking about Last on Earth? I have heard of that game. Maybe one day we'll play it. When the game doesn't create content, you make content, says Angel. Yep, that's why we're gonna reorganize the base so that the game feels a bit better. Oh Lord, what is this base? Seems very exotic. Uh, L D O E raid D N M I X A N. Uh, yeah, yeah, ladies and gents, this will be the sickest, probably raid you've seen, maybe, or maybe it won't be. I don't even know what's up. So, from what I believe, I have to enter from here. So, I'll need more than one C4. Okay, I'll get the rest of the C4s from the inbox. Doesn't matter. Let's go. I've done a little bit of research. Not, still not sure how to enter this base, but doesn't matter. I'm not going to spend more time. We have suburbs, but we cannot go to the suburbs. Yes, indeed. We have the helicopter, but we cannot use the helicopter. We have the trolley, ladies and gentlemen. We cannot use that trolley. We have... What else do we have? We have everything. But we cannot use that everything. Can we refill empty gas canisters in the repair table at the gas station? No, I don't think so. I haven't used that, but... I think we cannot... Okay, so they're not going to move through this ATV. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Let's get one more C4. Now, it looks like the, the game doesn't lag anymore. Before, it would lag whenever... Zombies spawn. I mean, it, okay, it started lagging. We have oil rig, but can't use it. Yep, we have the fifth and the sixth floor in Bunker Alpha, but we cannot go there. Eight years in the game is still in beta. The game is in beta for almost seven years. Next month, it'll be seven years, not eight, but the, your point still stands. Uh, I'm gonna use one more C4. You might be like, why, Cyric? Why not? What else am I gonna do with it? I should have saved those C4s maybe for a better base. But I'm gonna place a C4 on this thing. I'll be able to explode two more. Oh no, no sound. Oh no. There we go. Now, guys, you can hear things. I'm sorry you couldn't hear anything. That was quiet. Uh, apologies. Now you can hear stuff. I'm sorry. Hopefully you'll find some kindness in in your heart and you'll forgive me. We have these engines, but do I need any of them? Don't think so. We already have some of them at the base. Maybe I'll be able to bring one more, but then if you have too many of them at the base, you won't be able to pick up a generator in the abandoned factory. So, Did you get the Dragunov? Not yet. I was wondering why do I feel that something is missing, says Insane. Thanks, Insane. We have six bottles of pee. Absolutely have to go and add them to the chopper. Wait, maybe I'll get more items. Before going to the chopper. Get the Minecraft manger playing. I don't know why, but today I thought about Minecraft again. Probably still not going to play it on the channel. I've already played it. But hey, it was a Pog game. I absolutely loved it. It was phenomenal. That's all I have to say. A minigun! Hell yeah! Plus we have probably more things. Almost an entire tactical set. How awesome. Oh, there we go. There are the boots. 
Let's. Uh, we already had the boots here. Uh, Cyric, uh, hundred days hardcore Minecraft. Hmm. Probably die on day two. It's like, would you find some kindness in your heart and try Kitchen Simulator? Uh, after a last dinner stream for 10, 20 minutes. Oh my goodness. Stop being reasonable. Stop it. No. Stop being reasonable, though. I do not have the Kitchen Simulator game, though. I don't want to get it. I don't want to buy it. Does it make any sense? I bought Fallout 4 today because it was in promo for five, for 5 euros. I'm already 5 bucks down. I didn't even install the game. I just got it because it was in promo. Maybe I'll play it one day. I can't buy another useless game that I for sure won't play. Which is the Kitchen Simulator. Why you hate me? It's only 1 euro. Only 1 euro. That's an avocado. I think you might be wearing him down. Keep it up. You're not going to wear me down. Um... Why am I taking oak? There's nothing else to take in this base. That's why, probably. Okay, I'm gonna soften this box. I'm gonna get rid of the level 1 hatchets. Because it's easier to soften up these chests with... With axes. I think they do make a little bit less noise because the normal hatches, you need like 4 hits to explode the chest. Here, you need only 3. Explode the chest to open the chest. up this I gotta be careful around those silly engines because if I pick it up I will die a Zulu card hell yeah that's all I ever wanted a Zulu card Broken flare gun. I don't want to bring it. Okay, they do definitely spawn here kind of too fast. I'd be mad if I use 3C force for that. Yep. And plus wasted his uh, first aid kit on it. Let's open up another chest here. A zip gun. Yes, I'll steal it. Let's go up here. Open up the rest of these chests, ladies and gents, and then we're dipping out of here. That's it. I don't think there's anything else I need to take. Wait, there was actually something that I'd rather take instead of the zip gun and instead of my hatch. Oops, another first aid kit destroyed. Um. Oh, only four alcohol. Whatever. Still better than this broken hatchet. Almost got rid of the zip gun. We're bringing the zip gun back to the base. Do I even have space for the zip gun? I have no idea. In any case, we're leaving this base. So does this base get Sykes approval? I have no idea. We have gotten some tickets, so whatever. And 22 yellow ones. But 3C4 is for it. So does it get Sykes approval? I have no idea. It was at least an interesting base to raid. There are more things to do in this base rather than just the 3x3 base. So I don't even know. It was interesting, but the loot wasn't that good and I had to use 3C4s for it. So probably it's not worth it. Probably does not get Sykes approval. But I'd prefer to raid a base like this than a 3x3 base. Than a 3x3 stone base. I don't know. And Lars Robin Hjelm, thanks for the super chat. Here's one euro. Make him happy. Lol. Thank you, Lars Robin. Thank you for the super chat. Very cool. However, that doesn't mean that we will play that kitchen simulator. It doesn't mean that.
Um, I need to drop my coupons. Stone walls enough for raids? Nope. I mean, depends. If you have a lot of them, yes. You have to have lots of, like, level 1 walls, level 2 walls around that. You have to sub gave you money especially for that. So now if somebody gave you money and told me to buy crack or meth, that means I had to I have to buy meth. If a random stranger on the street gives you money and tells you to buy uh to buy meth, like you're gonna buy it. Doesn't make sense now, does it? And yes. I compared the kitchen simulator to hardcore drugs. There's that one person that probably does meth the daily. With cocaine, and he's like, huh, those are not hardcore drugs. <sighs> uh, let's drop the iron. Up here. I mean, both involve cooking. Hell yeah. Your examples are rubbish. Rubbish. Imagine using using the word rubbish. <laughs> and that's why I can't take you seriously. I'm sorry. I apologize, but imagine using the word rubbish. Bloody hell, that was rubbish. Uh, let's drop a pipe here. Whoops. Do I have a VSS? Yes, I do have a VSS inside of the trash box. How did it end up here? Makes no sense. How on earth this example that I gave was trash, or as you said, rubbish. It makes no sense. Somebody gave me $1 to buy kitchen simulator. And I said that no, because if somebody gives you money and they tell you, let's say to buy drugs, you don't buy them. That was like a hardcore example, obviously, over-exaggerated, but my point still stands. I don't see how you don't see that. I don't get it. Uh, let's drop the fuel canister. <sighs> the brain doesn't work! Where do I store? That's enough. That was a mini mental breakdown. That's it. Just a mini mental breakdown. If I was off camera, you already know that I'd eat like with this entire box, like this. If during the next live stream this box will be empty, you already know what I did with it. Same thing with the other box. It's just that it'll upset some people if I start deleting items on the stream, so I don't delete anything. But I, I said it. Roar says, "DA, stop it! Stop with this emo that does like, stop it! I'm not roaring, or am I? Hmm, no, I'm not roaring. Why would I roar?" But let's get ready to do another raid. There is a moral difference between drugs and a dumb game. There is a moral difference. That was example. I don't have to like give the exact example, otherwise example isn't gonna work now. Is it? So if a random stranger on the internet gives you a dollar, like they give you a dollar and they tell you go and steam and buy kitchen simulator. Like, would you do it? Hmm. There we go. The example is almost one to one right now. Um... I'll drop the other Glock and let's talk to the Raiders again. Let's see what other tasks I need to do. I would do it. You would buy the kitchen simulator. Very nice. Congrats. I'm glad to hear that. I'm going to craft some armor. Ladies and gentlemen, let's craft some armor and let's do another raid. We always talk about food. I haven't talked about food today yet. So that's not true. Hmm. 
dumb games are more addictive than drugs. I mean, I see what you're trying to say here. I wouldn't agree with that. But... Yes. Yes, but actually no, but whatever. And I need to open up a blue box. It's... Chad has a PhD in selling games. Maybe. Chad has a PhD in everything. That's a given. The chat has a PhD in everything. Collectively, guys, you are unstoppable. I wish I was part of the chat. Actually, I am part of the chat. I am part of the chat. There we go. Let's type that in the chat. I'm also part of the chat. I'm also unstoppable. Hell yeah. PhD in bullying, Cyric. We have seven blue cards. I have no idea how I've gotten them, but hey, I'm gonna open up one blue crate because that's what raiders want me to do. Oh, and I have 18 bottles of gasoline. Whatever, I'll drop it in the base later. Our savior has spoken, says Angel. What savior, though? I'm confused. Who is savior? Oh, no, I'm going to the wrong place. I just came up with, like, an insane... an insane thought. I'll forget about Buy it. Buy some avocado for the toast instead. D, then you can play kitchen simulator at home. In your own kitchen. Lars Robin, thanks for the super chat. There we go. That's much better. Yes. The the super chat will go towards the avocado. The the super chat will be invested on the avocados. Thank you. <laughs> thanks, Lars Robin. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. And that super chat uh, made me lose the thought. It was like something very genius. Uh oh yeah, so I, I said that I went to the wrong place. But I don't think there is there is no such thing as the wrong place. You can never be at the wrong place. You can be at the wrong place at the wrong time. Right? Because the wrong place can be the right place at the right time. Am I cooking, ladies and gentlemen? Am I braining today? The wrong place can be the right place at the right time. It can be applied to something. You can quote me. The wrong place can be the right place at the right time. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a perfect quote. Genius. Happy Cyric, philosopher 2024. Hell yeah. Let's open up the blue box. We've gotten the lightweight shutter. Very epic. So jail can be the right place at the right time. Gotcha, says insane. I mean, if I've done something uh, bad and deserving then, then yes, I guess. It'll be the right time. Told you, big head, big brain. Thank you, Flaming Fire. Thank you. And I'll bring this back to the base. Let's bring a wrench because, guys, you already know that we'll need those wrenches when the helicopter comes out. Not if, but when. I think what you mean is there is no wrong place, just the wrong times to schedule gaming guides. That's your quote, you can take it. It's a different quote. Yeah. I mean, it means the exactly same thing, I get it. And it, it sounds smarter, it sounds shorter. There is no wrong play, there is only the wrong time. But in any case. Write it down so you can cringe in the morning uh, reading it, says insane. Why would I cringe about that? I came up with that quote. Wait, what was the quote even? The wrong place can be the right place at the right time. It's a good quote. We need to be here. And uh, how do I do a... I need a screenshot. Wait. How do I... Can I sit here and like... How do I look smart? How do you look smart? You just look at the camera. Do I look smart? I'm not sure if I look smart, ladies and gentlemen. 
I have no idea. In any case, let's open up paint. The app of all apps. Oh no, it didn't work. God damn it. Of course it didn't work. Of course I messed it up. Okay, we gotta redo it again, ladies and gentlemen. We gotta redo it again. Do I look smart? I don't look smart. You have to look sick. <laughs> there we go. That's better. That is a little bit better, ladies and gentlemen. Totally do not look smart at all. In any case, pretend that I look smart. Stop it. Pretend that I look smart. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. Now you can see the... You can see paint. Uh, the... I mean, I won't be able to add... Why this thing disappears? The... Can you... How do... Why does this thing keep disappearing? Excuse me? Okay. It won't be good. Okay, whatever. There is no... There is no wrong place. Wait, how was the quote? I forgot the quote, ladies and gentlemen. What did I say? The right, there is no wrong place. Oh, uh, the wrong place. The wrong... The wrong place can be the right place at the right time. That's it. Cyric 2024. Uh, how, where's the, what's the better font? Because this font will be fine then. That's it. It's as good as it gets, guys. <laughs> certified memer. How is this certified memer? It was, it's not supposed to be a meme. It's not supposed to be a meme. Put it on your forehead. Okay, that's enough. Ladies and gentlemen, that is enough. That is enough. At the right time, a wrong place will be the right place. Yes, indeed, guys. You see, you can come up with your own quotes as well. Totally. The face is goaded. <laughs> Actually good. <laughs> Says insane. It is a good quote. And the face was smart, ladies and gentlemen. If I try, I can't look smart. But that's the thing, I can only look smart. Why not redesign your base, make it more spacious because your base looks horrible, says uh, Bishik Bandari. Is that all you had to say? Your base looks horrible. Why not make it more spacious? You tried to use all the words that trigger me, right? You forgot to add triple dot at the end of your sentence. That would have triggered me completely. As of right now, I'm just mildly infuriated. So, task failed. Better luck next time. Such an inspirational quote, says Flaming Fire. Thank you. Feel free to use it, ladies and gentlemen. Except every time you use it, make sure to pay me royalties and give me credits. And, uh, yeah. Totally. And Spladin, thanks for the super chat. Thank you. Welcome to the stream. Can you do a Let's Play series on Fallout 4? Maybe I'm considering it when the Fallout... Four comes out in at the end of April. Uh, there will be a next gen upgrade, a next gen update, so maybe then I'll play it. However, there are lots of uh, copyrighted soundtracks in Fallout 4, so I'm not sure about that. So I can't promise anything. I did buy Fallout 4 today, though. Because it's it was on promo on Steam, so I got it. Uh, bandages first aid kits and alcohol. Bandages first aid kits. Do I even need this? I'm an idiot. I'm just gonna do the raid. Luigi says clipped. I did what? Do you accept avocados as payments? Yes. What a silly question. If. I was the... If I would rule the world, I would make avocados the global payment. Money would cease to exist. 
you would do all of your purchases with avocados. You want to buy a new iPhone? 300 avocados. Everything would be with avocados. All the payments would be done with avocados. Have the radio turned off and follow for no music, just background music. When you turn off the radios, they still play. You can't turn off those radios fast enough, I guess. It's from what I've heard. Um, what else do I need to do here? Oh, the hatchets. That's what we're doing. But hey, maybe there will be a Fallout 4 playthrough. We'll see. I don't know. Again, it would be a very long playthrough and I'd love to play it, but I don't really know how it would perform on the channel. So if I start playing Fallout 4, if I do like two or three live streams, I'll still need to do like 10 more live streams. And if nobody's watching them, I kind of don't want to quit the game midway throw. But I also will not want to finish it. I, like I can finish it off camera. But I will not want to play it if people won't watch it. So. It's quite a predicament. Isn't it? Uh, let's get more first aid kits. Axis. I did get the axes. I did get the C4. We have the guns. They're upgraded. We have enough armor. Let's now do the second raid of the day. How many avocados for the kitchen simulator? I don't even know. There aren't enough avocados in the world for me to play kitchen simulator. You can always try new games like kitchen simulator. Hell yeah. Might be an option in the settings to turn music volume down. I think you wouldn't hear it. Maybe it's been a while since I played this casual gaming guides. Maybe. I was just on the internet the other day. I was surfing the web and uh, I saw lots of people complain about that Fallout 4 that you can't really turn off the radios. There are mods for it that let you turn it off, but if they release the next gen upgrade, I don't think those mods will work. And I've gotten a meme from last, uh, from Insane. I almost called you last on Earth. I don't even know what it was, but hey, we're going to check it out. Think and say. Sometimes when I close my eyes, I can't see. <laughs> Why is it so blurry? Insane. Thanks for the for the meme. But explain to me why is it so blurry? Is it on purpose or are you watching in like 144p, homie? What is this quality? What is this? What is this? I am very confused. Is that how you see me, guys? Like those that, let's say, watch the videos in 144p, right? And now you see this picture. Is this picture even worse? It's on purpose. I got the better quality as well. This is insane. Okay, I get it. It's on purpose. Is... So those that watch in 144p, how... What do you see here right now? You probably don't see anything. I see you worse than that. Yikes. Mm. Well, if you've done it on purpose, then you did it. You did it very well. I like it. If you haven't done it on purpose, then I'm sorry that that's what you have to look at. <laughs> I apologize. In any case, let's uh, do the second raid of the day. Thank you for the epic meme insane. Thank you. Wait, sometimes when I close the eyes, I can't see for real. I think that meme is... Is onto something. I think Insane knows something that I don't know. LDOE Raid Player 8909. And let's see what this base has to offer. Okay, so I think I already know how to enter this raid. I don't see you. I think my eyes are closed. This flaming fire. Open them. Open them right now. Low definition helps not to scare the children. I think it's quite the opposite. I'm not that ugly. Sometimes means that usually when he closes his eyes, he can see his angel. Well, I didn't even think of that. He's definitely onto something. What do you always look flabbergasted, says Kian? How else am I supposed to look like? Um, 
Let's start opening up these chests. Will I be able to open up all of them? I don't know. We'll see. It's a very simple base. We just need to open up these chests and that's it. Stop it! What an idiot. Oh, we've gotten some coupons. Hell yeah. I'll take a, plus a box, a skull crusher inside of that box. 480p forehead. It says Farampa. Okay. How much money to play Kitchen Simulator, says Freeman. There isn't enough money in the world for me to play Kitchen Simulator. Nothing. What's with the new update? So to those that have just joined, inside of the new update, uh, we haven't gotten lots of new things. As developers said, it was a technical update, right? But you can now auto clear green zones once every few hours uh, using ads. So you can auto clear the green stone and the green wood zone. You can also use ads to skip items in the recycler or in the settlement. You can also skip items now in the acid bath by watching ads. Maybe something else that I've missed, but yeah, that's about it. Nothing useful, nothing. I mean, everything was useful inside of that box. All of those rubber parts, all of those ball bearings will be used to assemble the helicopter when the helicopter comes out. Am I right? I'll get more iron, an entire stack of turkey. What is this chat says flaming pie fire? I have no idea. Welcome to my world. And I think we're dipping out of here. That's it. Does this raid get my approval? I have no idea. Don't have a slightest clue. Okay, so the game just wants to make more money. I see, says zero. Exactly. Yes. I just got an insane idea. If people want to send messages in the chat, YouTube has to force them to watch an ad. Millionaire Cyric, hell yeah. Um, let's try to give probably the stack of turkey to the doggos. That'll be enough for nine hours. This, let's also add some more tickets. Yellow tickets. Where do I store them? How on earth is this entire box full of stuff? I'm getting rid of these ration coupons, right? I'm going to go to Bunker Alpha and I'm going to exchange all of these green tickets for for whatever. And just like that, the acid bath is almost full again. Yep. Just like that. That's it. I'm emptying that stupid bookshelf <laughs> gears for the helicopter deleted three bolts for the helicopter deleted 
will never be able to financially recover from that. And a Glock. There we go. Let's drop it. Now, let's pay the Raiders. Seems true. New York could trust you. Okay, let's share this. And did I call them? Probably I did call them again. Now, let's get more tickets. All of these green, green ones. Now let's exchange all of them. Maybe I will save uh, some in Bunker Alpha. We should do a video explaining what loot is worth taking for new players. I definitely wasted a lot of time taking loot I didn't need, says Bethany. Uh, there is an entire... It would be very complicated because you need everything in this game. Like, everything has a purpose, so it would be difficult to explain. Like, should you take uh, wires? Like, I don't know. Depends on the loot. Depends what else you have to get rid of. Depends on your situation. So yeah, basically the free-to-play series explain that. People can watch what loot I take in the free-to-play series and they can decide for themselves. Because but yeah, that video would be very difficult to make. <laughs> Eat the tickets. You know those three bolts will be the exact amount you will need to complete the helicopter build. Now you'll have to go and find more, says Northern Zombie. Absolutely. It's fine, I'm ready to do that. Pro says, bro, remove headphones and show us your head sideways. Pro, is that all you want? Is there anything else you'd like to see? Is that all, homie? I have no idea what happens. What goes through some people's mind? They enter a live stream, and the first thing they do, like, it's like we move the headphones and uh, show the head sideways. Like that's it. That's that's all you. Ha what what's going through your head? Take off the clothes. Thing says Dan K. Hell yeah. I'd really like to know what's going on in your head. But why? I'm confused. Okay, let's get the floppy crate. Let's give all of these tickets. Another one. Let's give all of these tickets and let's get all of the floppy crates. I'm gonna leave 150 green tickets. You know what? 100 tickets. Because we always get more green tickets. I'm pretty sure you have a headset bend. Says Joseph. Joseph Patritz. What's... And if I have a headset bend. First of all, what, what's a bend? And even if I do, then what's up with that? How does that change your life? I just try to check the streamer's head bend by wearing headphones for a long time, says Pro. Okay, good for you. Keep trying. My son will be an engineer when he grows up. No, no, my son will be a doctor. My son will be an astronaut. Their son. Uh, wait, I'll read that message. Their son. I just try. I just check streamers' headbands by wearing headphones for a long time. You made it, bro. You made it. <laughs> you made it. It's like if you hit 500k subs, will you play Kitchen Simulator? <laughs> We'll see, guys. If you act well, maybe I'll play some Kitchen Simulator at the end of the live stream. But at the same time, do I really want to... I'm just, I'm just sick and tired of seeing that Kitchen Simulator. If I play it for like 20 minutes. For 10 minutes, will you guys stop? OMG, yes. Will you guys stop if I play that Kitchen Simulator? Will you guys stop talking about it? I mean, I'll check if it's more than one dollar. I ain't playing it. That's all I'm saying. I don't even know how the kitchen simulator looks like. 
Kitchen Sim... Kitchen Simulator 2005? Uh, 2015, I mean, or Kitchen Simulator 2? Both of them are one dollar. I think you're talking about Kitchen Simulator 2. But it looks kind of weird. And there are only 84 reviews in this game. I'm not playing it. Brother, I'm not playing neither of those games. There are 84 reviews and it has mixed reviews. I'm not doing it. Kitchen Simulator 2, it has 84 reviews. <sighs> so that's it. We, you can guys forget about it. It's not even a serious game. Disappointment is immeasurable. My day's been ruined, says DA. Excuse me. Play World of Warcraft. Go play Rust. Wipe has one day at Ghost of Sierra. There are lots of different servers that wipe on different days. And at different times. Well, there is no kitchen simulator. That's it, guys. You can forget about it. That's it. No more kitchen simulator. However, there is something better. There's something a lot better, ladies and gentlemen. Just listen to it. Do you hear that? Do you know what that is? You'll never guess it, ladies and gentlemen. So, bloody supermarket simulator, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the kitchen simulator. So, we're gonna do just one day here, I guess. Uh, have I restocked everything here last time? I am not sure I have, but hey, let's probably start the day. Wait, what happened? Why is it 9 p.m.? Why I haven't finished the day? Okay, that's interesting. Let's start the next day and uh, the pasta panzari changed the price. So that's it, guys. No more kitchen simulator. We have the supermarket simulator. Working like a dog. Yes, indeed. We're working like dogs. Okay, so I need different pasta. Okay, let's add this pasta. Let's buy some cereal. Let's buy milk and water. Water, milk. I cannot buy anything else, that's it. Let's quickly sort that out. This game has such a good story. Yes, indeed, it's prequel to Last on Earth. We were the grocery store workers. I was a cashier before the Last on Earth apocalypse. Okay, the frozen chicken, where would I store it even? I know I placed it somewhere here-ish. Oh, here we can place more chickens, yeah. Uh, the flower. Yo, DA, thanks for being a member for 21 months. Uh, 20 whole British months. And you won't play Kitchen Simulator. You should be ashamed, says DA. I check checked for Kitchen Simulator, but it looked like a pretty goopy game. I don't know, maybe it's a good game, I don't know. I bought too much pasta then, and too much cereal, maybe. And we've gotten a new meme from Insane. We have to check it out. We must check out that new meme from Insane. It's a must, ladies and gentlemen. New memes from Insane, I don't even check- Oh, it's a better quality now. Excuse me, whoops. Uh, there we go. I thought I was happy because I was Cyric. Turns out I am Cyric because I'm happy. <laughs> Thanks, Insane. Thank you. Very, very cool. I'm Cyric because I'm happy. Doesn't make any sense. I have no idea. Maybe. Wait, and some of you said to check out the cooking simulator. For real? Cooking uh, simulator. 
Bro, cooking simulator 1679. You gotta be kidding me. I'm not getting it, even if it was a dollar. Guys, stop it. Don't read that every morning. I'm about to do it. Should have gone with the 480p. Should have gone with the 144p. <laughs> the pixelated quality is funny. But hey, that one was also great. All the memes are bug. Okay, we need... Uh, what other big boxes I can add here? Okay, so orange juice. Let's add some orange juice. What if it costs 98 cents? There's the kitchen simulator. That costs like 99 cents or something. And I... Didn't play that. I should have gotten more orange juice. Oh, there's one more box with orange juice. Actually, I did get more of it. Uh, let's buy one more cleaner. I'll buy the cleaner. What else do we need to buy here? We'll buy the smaller box as soon. Okay, I need ketchup. Let's buy some. Is that even ketchup? Or is that hot sauce? I won't even know. That's got to be ketchup, probably. Let's buy two boxes of ketchup. Let's buy... Oh, no. Actually, ketchup will be more than that. Ketchup needs six. So that's two, three, four, five, six. And mayo. Maybe let's get three mayos. There are terminals inside. There are definitely people are already here checking out. They're working. Like dogs. Just some kind of restocking the warehouse. That's kind of all you do once you get a bigger warehouse. And once you get more workers. They just beep out everything inside of that supermarket. some of this. I mean, for the content, we could open this up. Right, maybe somebody will get to the checkout store. To the checkout line, to the checkout registry. Uh, let's add some more mayo. What else do we need? More olive oil? Not really. Okay, we don't have any more sushis at all. Sushi, large and small sushis. Let's get those. That stuff is expensive. Psych has only fancy. It's my part-time job. Again, milk. Obviously, I'm joking, ladies and gents. Oh, we got a, our first customer. Yeah, yeah. Uh, is there anything else that I'd like to buy? Uh, Coke. That's gotta be basic Coke. That's uh, soda. Okay, what else do I need here? They're out of chickens. They're buying those chickens like... Like animals and potatoes, chickens and potatoes, chickens and potatoes. You left a box outside, oh no, oh no. There are probably some boxes on the floor even, there's the box of peanut butter. I have to do everything manually. Where do we even store that peanut butter? There we go, here. Okay, there's one more box with ketchup up here. And that customer is still waiting to get checked out. Stupid customer, am I right? Yeah, that customer can still wait. They won't disappear. They'll just stay there and that's it. They don't complain about the long waiting times. At least I don't think so. Uh, more chickens. Uh, Pepsi goes up here. 
We got the potatoes, ladies and gentlemen. Potatoes. Okay, that's enough. Let's now check out some customers. Why on earth all these people are waiting here and not with this one number three? Idiots. Bunch of idiots. Well, whatever. I'm going to show them how it's done then. Uh, 121.9. 70 cents. and 30 cents uh, 78.4 the dude got a lot of french fries more french fries and a bunch of that moussaka okay so what else do we need in the morning we'll need to buy some things as i said we need a beeper in our hand so that i can beep here for example i beep and it'll add one uh, sugar box on the computer. We need to buy more. We need to be allowed to buy more than just 10 things at the same time. Are they adding boars in the game? They're adding boars in LDOE, maybe for the event? I'm not sure. I have no idea, to be completely honest with you. Okay, pasta's already there. And apple juice is there as well. Okay, cool. I need more milk. So let's add the big milk. Let's add the crab sticks. I'll need the cleaning soap, cleaning products. What is this? Uh, cheese. Uh, cheese. Three boxes of that. I need one more box of tuna. And is there anything else? Uh, one more french fry. I think. There we go. We'll buy all of that in the morning then. Let's check out one more customer. One, one, two, thirty. It's like last dinner. It will add helicopter when you play the kitchen simulator. Gu guys, stop it. I mean, I checked out the chi the kitchen simulator. It was... Uh, almost nobody played that game. It's pretty goopy. I was ready to check it out if it was something okay, but I mean, I don't know. Then if I check that game out, then it'll open the Pandora box for other games that I'll need to check out. Chicken Simulator. Oh, that's it. We're done with this day. Hell yeah. What did we get? Uh, 2K. Six. So chicken cake, bottled water. Chicken cake, bottled water. Chicken cake. Bottled water chicken. Cake. Chicken cake. Bottled water. Okay, we did everything except the chicken then. 1.7. And let's buy all of this here. I assume. Pandora box simulator when... I have no idea. An update 1.69 for 2024 20, 7. The trash looks more vibrant, says you gotta be kidding me. Probably that's what'll happen in the future updates. We won't even get new icons, they'll just look a bit more vibrant. The milk goes there. Wait, the cinema, they took all of the pasta. Animals. The french fries. Uh, wait, they go in the back. What do you guys think of my organizing skills? Excuse me? YouTube says that it's lagging. Is the live stream lagging? It's not lagging. It shouldn't be lagging. So YouTube is lying. It's like toilet stream when- Why would there be a toilet live stream? 
Guys, are you nuts? Why would there be a toilet live stream? Actually, who am I kidding you in? Okay, let's get normal pasta. I need both of those. And I need bleach. And I'm pretty sure toilet paper is gone. Yep, we do not have any more toilet paper and bleach. So let's get bleach. Let's get the one, two, three, four toilet papers. Let's quickly sort that out. The skibbity toilet. Yeah, I have no idea. There is like some sort of a meme with the skibbity toilet. I have no idea what that is. And I'm glad I don't know that. There we go. I'm not really sure what that is. I just know it's like some sort of a new meme. It's probably an old meme at this point. It's like food cam. When? Why would there be a food cam? Is there a need for it? Uh, 2 out of 10 organizing skills, you're throwing everything. But I'm throwing them in an organized manner. Aren't I? Okay, let's drop... These uh, here. And you know what? We could probably start the day. We could probably restock that thing, but hey, let's start the day. We can keep buying new things. Okay, so we need... We don't really need lots of shampoo stuff. I just usually buy bigger boxes. Let's buy bread. I'll buy two bigger boxes of bread. I'll need one flour. Do I need one more pasta? No, we don't need one more pasta. We need milk again. They drank all of it. Animals. Milk. We need one pizza, one ice cream. I think we need both of these pizzas and an ice cream. Ice cream. There we go. Let's buy all of that. Top tier organizing. Thank you. Oh, I had a box here. Oh, that's why I didn't have enough milk. Because I didn't put the milk here. Okay. I'll add more bread. And while the customers are coming in, I still think I can work here a bit more in the warehouse. I need to get a part-time job in the warehouse. That'd be poggers. I already have here, like, what, 15 hours in this game? So I already have 15 hours of experience. I think they'll hire me. Heck, they'll beg me to, to work for them. The uh, pizza's gotta be somewhere here-ish. The new pizza. Oh, the new pizza's already full. Okay, so I was mistaken. We need chicken, then. Chicken and one potato. Uh, two chickens and one potato. Let's buy chickens, potato. We need now six cheese. Uh, cheese. One, two, three. One, two, three. There we go. Let's buy all of that. So the best strategy that I found is restocking big boxes first and then only buying those smaller boxes when practically all of them go away. When you run out of these smaller boxes, because you can store six of them, so... It's a lot easier to buy six boxes at the same time and then just forget about them than keep rebuying like one box every time you lose it or something. Oh, we have more potatoes. These boxes here, they stress me. I'm gonna move them here for now and flower goodness they felt like this now these boxes will stress me god damn it <laughs> that milk has become yogurt by now says so insane that's a good one hell yeah I can probably confirm that. Then what has this yogurt become? I don't think I've restocked yogurt in a long time, but it's still all there. We have like some... <laughs> we have like... Look at this. The amount of yogurt here. I just spoke... Speaking of yogurt, there we go. She's going to buy some of it. Like this yogurt just stayed there probably for like three weeks now already. Nobody's buying it. And uh, yogurt here, nobody's buying it either. Because nobody's buying that other yogurt. Uh, 
chocolate. I'm gonna buy five chocolates and there's a customer waiting. One, two, three, four, five. Stop it. Imagine we could play games on the computer here. That would be insane. Playing some Last on Earth here on the break. Um, let's check out some of these customers real quick. They don't need no change. Wow, that's a lot of products. Uh, 98.2. There we go. What else do I need to buy here? More potatoes? They never have enough potatoes. Apparently. I think I should buy more potatoes, maybe like four bags of uh, potatoes, four boxes of potatoes instead of just two. Maybe that's what I should do for real. I should have like an entire... Yeah, I'll have more potatoes and more chicken. Maybe that's what I'll do. Perhaps. Got in another customer. Okay, so everything is kind of full. I don't need to get anything else, I assume. Whatever. Let's check out another customer then. It's like supermarket is booming. The supermarket is booming indeed. Look at those potatoes! A ridiculous amount of potatoes. I haven't had potatoes in months. Uh, 86.2. It's like open a supermarket IRL. I mean, I do have experience now. I'm sure running a real supermarket is as easy as <laughs> playing the supermarket simulator. Beef. Oh yeah, speaking of beef, I might not have enough meat here. I actually do have enough meat. Great. Okay, these things are almost empty. We could buy some hand soap, like five of it. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, while I have the time. And, uh, what else do I need? Cereals? I need all cereal. There we go, let's buy three of these cereals. He took that common years about becoming something meaningful to society seriously. Yes, sir. Finally, I'm gonna open my supermarket store. Would that be useful to society if I open up another supermarket store? But there are already super, uh, lots of supermarket stores out there. I think that still, that still would be useful. Uh, the soap here. The cereal. We should have more cereal. And okay, we still have a little bit of milk. Yuck, yeah. I'm still surprised our business is booming. I left to get a haircut, checking in to say a quick funny, but now leaving to the supermarket IRL, says Rudy. Do be like that. Good luck with the supermarket trip. Good luck with that. And we have a couple of customers here. It's a lot of toilet paper for one person. Should be punished. Okay, that's it. Nobody else is here. I mean, there are... Oh, there's only one person. Mm, 
uh, ever try to charge customers more money? Is it even possible? I think you can overcharge them by like five, ten cents or whatever. Depends on the amount of money they give. Depends on the order. But most of the time, you can't really overcharge them too much. We have 6k, ladies and gents. Not too shabby. And they took all of the pasta. So let's get both of those. I need one more simple pasta. And one more bleach. Um, I think that's going to be good enough. Let's end the day then. We definitely got like at least a K. 2K maybe? 1,700. Heck yeah. Bleach pizza and apple. Bleach pizza, apple. Bleach pizza, apple. Bleach pizza, apple. Bleach pizza, apple. Okay, bleach went down in price. Bleach, uh, pizza. Which pizza though? Not this one. Oh, wow. Bleach pizza and apples. Might as well not sell those pizzas at all. Same thing with the apple juice. Let's quickly restock some of this. Excuse me, sir. What is this big box? Okay, the... This. Apple juice. Still no space for the apple juice there. Um, could buy some milk water. Okay, so two different types of milk. I need one of this, one of this, and one water. We need more items and we need to get more licenses. If I have enough space in the store for that. We should buy more coffee. Uh, let's buy five coffee. Coffee, one, two, three, four, five. Is there anything else I need to buy? One more cleaner. Uh, one more flour. And olive oil five. Okay, that's not going to fit in this order then. Um, I don't even know. One more chicken and toilet paper. Uh, chicken and two more toilet papers. Buy some floor space. We could buy more space here. Like, we will unlock this corner then. I'll be able to add more shelves. We should probably do that. What the hell are you playing, says Nemesis? What are we playing? We're playing Kitchen Simulator. What do you mean, what am I playing? Game of the year, game of the 2024. What am I playing? What is that question? I feel offended. I'm getting experience for my IRL job. Paper, cleaners, and more coffee. Well, I don't even know what else we could do here. I think the store is full enough-ish. Okay, we need more olive oil. Olive oil, need five of it. Okay, let's get five olive oil. Another cleaner then again. Uh, finally, I can drop the apple juice. There we go. Now we need uh, three more hot sauces. Uh, one, two, three. And I could buy one more box of something. One more box of cereal. Okay, we need three boxes of different cereal. I'll just get water then instead. And then I'll buy three different cereals. Expanding the CV. Yes, indeed. My CV is empty. 
basically. I worked in construction, kinda, for a while. I worked at the at a sawmill for for a while. Almost lost my hand. Then worked at a factory. Played last on Earth for six, seven years, and now getting experience here in the supermarket business. See you, ladies and gentlemen. Smart. Smart. Uh, let's get some water. And more olive oil will be dropped here. Took a while to restock this stuff. You gotta be kidding me. Well, we restocked mostly everything then. Experienced researcher, YouTube Blast and Earth Raids. That's also true. Do we start one more day? Kitchen Simulator. I mean, if we played Kitchen Simulator, I could probably get more experience. Whatever, let's start one more day. Don't even know why. But let's do it. I'll just wait until maybe more things disappear off the shelves. Okay, we need shampoo. They took all of it. Animals. Dirty animals, quite literally. Six of those. That's it. You know what? I'll stop buying things one by one. I'll just buy everything. I mean, when I don't have anything to do here, when I'm waiting for customers. Maybe, I don't know. In any case, we'll see. Say one thing and then I do the other one. If you play Kitchen Simulator, you could work in a restaurant. That is... True. But would they accept me? I don't know. In any case, let's drop... This there. And I need sugar now. We don't have any more sugar. Let's buy two boxes of sugar. And what about Pablo sugar? Pablo sugar has to be somewhere here-ish, no? I've unlocked Pablo sugar. Recently, and I don't see it in the... On the shelves. Bro, where's Pablo sugar? Here, maybe? Toilet paper, salt. Uh, honey, this, mozzarella, tuna. Oh, that was Pablo Sugar up there, probably. That wasn't tuna, that was Pablo Sugar. Go, let's buy it. Don't question me why there's Pablo. Oh, we have six Pablo Sugars. Heck yeah. I don't even know why we have Pablo Sugars up here then. Doesn't make sense, but it's okay. So let's buy four more Pablo sugars, I guess. One, two, three, four. Interviewer hired. Hell yeah. Do you have an experience, sir? I got 20 hours in Kitchen Simulator. I mean, that would be good, but I have zero hours in Kitchen Simulator. And it'll stay that way. I'll make sure that it stays that way. Okay, let's deal with a couple of my customers. Hello, animals. Got hungry again. And for that reason, guys, I cannot have a supermarket IRL. Because I'm not allowed to talk to customers that way. They'll sue me. And I'll be like, Your Honor, you weren't there. You can't... Don't trust them. Cleaner. I'll need two cleaners. Anything else? 
Two cleaners. A bit. A small sushi. One small sushi. I need. I could get a sushi large as well. Let's get small sushi and sushi large. Give all the money in the register. You cannot give them too much either. I mean, you can actually give them lots of change. Yes, you can. But that wouldn't be cool enough. What is this? Who do you think I am, Mr. Beast? The next customer that buys stuff in this store gets all of my money. Is that it? Okay, I thought I'd definitely have more boxes. I am somewhat like Mr. Beast. Okay, so I can give her a penny. Okay, this dude needs change zero, but I take five cents from me. She needs 30 cents, so I take 25 cents. And obviously she's not going to be happy about that. She needed 30, she got 25 only. So I still profited. Even by doing some charity. I've done some charity to two people, and yet I robbed one person. So that means I st I'm still net positive. What happens if you don't pay the bills? Do they have IRS or something? I mean, uh, speaking of bills, I haven't paid them in a while. Oh, Lord. Probably don't need to pay all of them at once, but hey, let's pay all of them. That's it, I'm out of money. Thanks for reminding me about the bills. Nothing really happens, they just pay themselves automatically. I mean, you, you will, the, the money will be taken from your account. But hey, let's buy two chickens. I need more chickens, though. That's it, I'm buying more chickens. A chicken. One, two, three, four. Because buying two chickens every time here is very annoying. We need more space for chickens. Okay, so I'll store chickens up here and chickens down here. Does it make sense? No. Don't question me. Things don't have to make sense. We have another customer. Hello, sir. What if your account is zero? Uh, I mean, we still have things in the store, so we will always have money. Unless I give it all away, then we'll have zero money. And then how on earth am I going to proceed? You can get a loan here. If you get zero, you can still get a loan. How much for another license? Uh, for 2k, we could unlock cheese, a new coffee, new bottled water, uh, bio eggs. We could unlock new pasta, another sugar, and more tea. Okay, sorry, you need that Pablo sugar, I see. Pablo powdered sugar. It's a lot of chicken. Yeah, let's close the thing before anybody else comes in. Because I'm sure they will. Okay, there's still only a couple of people left. Stupid customers! Chop, chop. Should have charged them 100 on the card. You cannot charge more. When you have to pay by card, uh, you can't really overcharge them. Why they're all so short? I mean, they're all normal height, I'd say. Some of them are shorter, some of them are taller. I was just on top of the... Uh, cash registry. So I'm calling them stupid, but they're the reason why he's in business. That's why they're stupid. I mean, look at them. Why does she need so much rice, so much coffee, and so much candy? Like, what do you need? What do you do? 
Look at all of these pizzas that they get, all the mozzarellas, the yogurts. There's no 70 cents. Get out of here. That is it. That's probably the last customer. We did it. Finally, so we probably should have profited something. 700, maybe 1,700. Hell yeah. So bio eggs, four pack, change the price. Let's change the price on the bio eggs. Uh, there they are. Uh, 2.6. There we go. And ladies and gents, I think on that note, we're going to be buckling up. So thanks everybody for joining. Thanks for checking out this. Uh, the brand new Last on Earth update. Thanks for checking out the uh, Supermarket Simulator. Wait, we have to save the game or... Or yeah, there will be troubles. So thanks everybody for being here. Maybe all of the prices on yogurt. The pr People don't really complain about the prices on yogurts. The prices on yogurts are fine. And it doesn't really matter if they don't buy them, they don't buy them. Like, I... Doesn't matter. Don't really need to sell it. So thanks everybody. For being here thanks for everything thanks insane for making epic memes thank you guys for chatting thank you guys for watching uh thank you for everything and see you tomorrow with another video hopefully tomorrow there should be a last in earth video yes there should be a video so yeah take care ladies and gents and peace out everybody shout out to all of you once again and take care take care everybody peace out